Layer masking gives you the opportunity to erase away pixels without actually deleting them. It's a non-destructive means of editing a layer. So to create a layer mask, first of all, choose the layer you want to work on. In our case, I want to get rid of this white around the dog so I can see the gradient behind it. With the layer selected, at the bottom of the layers palette, you can either click on the center option to add a layer mask, or you can go up to the layer drop-down menu choose New Layer Mask and either Reveal All or Hide All. I like to use Reveal All. Either way, we'll add another icon to whatever layer you're working on. This is the mask layer. Be aware that you're working in the mask layer or the picture layer. And if you're trying to do the mask, make sure the mask is uh, selected when you're working. Next, choose your paintbrush tool. Wherever I paint black inside of this area, it'll mask it off. Wherever I paint white, it'll unmask it. So let's change our fill color and make sure that it's painted in black. Now you can see when I click inside the area, it looks like it's erasing it away. And if we look in our layer mask, you can see it'll give me a preview of what it looks like. So with this, as long as I'm painting black, it'll uncover, or excuse me, cover up that area. But if I make a mistake and accidentally paint something, all I've got to do is swap my fill, ground, fill color from black to white, and it will unmask that particular area from there. So you can see how this is a great way of undoing or um, keeping those pixels from uh, completely being erased. Another thing to keep in mind is you don't have to just work in black and white. If you do choose a middle gray, so for instance I chose something like this, it will see, keep masking it off, but just at a lower opacity. 